Hi, I'm Dr. Tina Ramchandran. I'm a medical cosmetologist, consultant dermatologist, laser and dermatosurgeon at Dr. Tina Skin Solutions in Sarkar Nagar, Bangalore. So the effects of swimming on skin and hair are many and uh, mainly attributed to chlorine and uh, the UV radiation which is reflected off the water. So chlorine is a gas which is commonly used to disinfect the pools and it's necessary to keep the pool hygienic and uh, there is according to the uh, standardized version the exact amount of chlorine should be used but sometimes you have people using either overusing it or underusing it and because of that you end up having troubles. Now what troubles exactly happen with chlorine being overused would be you have more of absorption of chlorine which happens any which ways and when chlorine is absorbed you have something called as a swimmer's teeth you have erosions on the teeth there are people who also end up having uh, a scaly dry flaky skin and any person who already has a xerotic or dry skin those issues become worser and uh, people who have dry hair the dryness increases if they have a colored hair the color gets bleached and uh, there are a lot of other issues because of the UV radiation as in 25 percent of UV gets reflected off the water so you have uh, that induced sun tanning which people always observe when they go swimming. So there are other challenges with swimming as in the chlorine depletes the protein and makes everything dry and uh, there are people who go in for premature aging, the spots, sunspots, age spots are a lot more. There are uh, some incidences of cancer association but uh, that's not proved yet with studies and uh, so these are the side effects of swimming I could say.